Howdy, Commander's Echo here. This uh, Commander's Week thing in the store. Let's take a fresh first look at it. I haven't checked it out at all. I was about to go into it and look at it, and then the little, you know, like, pop-up thing came up. So let's take a look at it with fresh eyes together and see what it's all about. The pop-up thing says, buff up your roster of legendary commanders this Commander's Week. There's a bunch of bundles available in the store to help build your personal armada. I.e., we need more money, slash spreadsheet says not enough people have high enough level commanders, slash comment section is griping that there's not enough P.O.s and Zygnias out there, so. What? Oh, no, that's not what that says. Anyway, let's check it out, see what they got. Admiralty College. Let's take a look at this bundle, huh? Give your commander roster a major booth, boost with a ton of commander progression items, big crates, garbage, and a bunch of commander crates. Please note, duplicate commanders are converted into personal commendations, just like normal. What do you get out of this? You get an insignia. One whole insignia. That'll help get you one guy from 13 to 14. 25,000 global XP, which has nothing to do with commanders. 10 POs. whoop de doo That's enough to get uh, two guys promoted from 6 to 7. 15 commander crates that will help you fill out your roster, or if you've got a full roster, that will be 15 randomized personal commendations, 10 garbage crates, and forged in combat. Doesn't say what it is. One reward. I think it's going to be a universal commendation. That's usually what these missions are that come with these type of bundles. For 19900 that's basically like $66 US, if you're buying doubloons $100 US at a pop. Renowned Commanders. Oh, you can buy your way through the campaign. 75 Renown. Excellent. Five Commander Crates and three stages of the campaign for like $20.75. Decorated commanders, one insignia and five promotion orders. Again, for that, like, $20.75 US. Bonus commanders! So normally they're charging, like, $7,500 for a five commander bundle, I think. Uh, so you get a sixth one, and it's a slight discount. Funded commanders... Pay for 1.15 million silver. Woo! Same thing, you're just going to get five commander crates with some premium time. Probably five commander crates with some type 4 camos. A whole 11 of them. That needs to be like 100 of them. If you're spending real money on consumable camos, it needs to be a lot of them. This is just going to be with six whole promotion orders. <laughs> You can make one guy level 6 and then have one PO left over. Some small daily containers, 15 of them. Some global XP that has no bearing on commander promotion. And a whole two big crates that are full of garbage. Wow. This is a pretty great uh, special tab here, Wargaming. Leaves a lot to be desired. Anyway, that was my very first initial no BS, no filter reaction to this uh, page. For those of you out there, I, I, you know, you're my audience. I do try to look out for you. That's why I put out like the PSAs and the quick notifications of stuff. I would strongly consider what I'm spending my money on. Let's put it that way. Uh, personally, I don't think any of these bundles are worth it. This one here, the Admiralty College is a nice set of package. I mean, don't get me wrong. That's a lot of good stuff there. That's functionally like 15 personals plus a universal. 10 big crates. You know, you'll get some stuff out of that. 10 POs and an insignia. But for that price, no way. You can buy 15 commander crates in a total of 5 weeks by just grinding silver. Now granted, that's a lot of silver. But if you go to the containers tab... Scroll to the right here. Here it is. 10,500,000 for a triple commander pack. That resets every Monday. So as long as you grind 10,500,000 silver or credits, 
You can buy three commanders for free, literally free. All it takes is playing the game. Doesn't cost doubloons. You don't have to swipe your credit card. You can buy that same number of commander crates in six weeks total, as long as you're grinding that 10.5 million silver every week. That is a lot of silver. That is a lot of grinding. It's a lot of like tier six premium games. You got to forego buying ships off the tech tree or upgrading them. I understand, but if you're in a position where you need to like fill up your roster or you're in a position where you want to get some personal accommodations kind of at random, this is a way better way to go, in my opinion. Well, thanks an awful lot for listening, Commanders. This has just been a little bit of a bonus there. This popped up. I didn't even know it was coming, this special Commanders Week thing. So just thought we'd do a little impromptu video, first reaction, <laughs> kind of gut reaction as I read through them. So again, thanks an awful lot for listening. I greatly appreciate it. And as always, stay salty, Commanders.